Uh, Brookshire Brook, and Brookshire is a grocery store. You're only going and spending twenty dollars. Go and get like dinner for the kids sometimes. Yeah, I think we should probably meal prep. Yeah. So, so what are you doing? Spending two hundred? Oh, well, ATM would draw two hundred dollars. ATM would draw two hundred dollars, and there's yeah. your little cheap grocery store dinner. There's your Amazon uh, grocery store dinner, Chick Fil A. So we're certainly spending. So you don't go crazy. So if you saw the last Starbucks, that's the la- That's the day that I learned about you. <laughs> Have you had a single fun purchase since then? Um, be honest. Not really. I, so, if you go back to the beginning, there was a Texas coffee. Um, that was for my son because he got shots that day. So, I took him to get a smoothie and a muffin. No one takes me to get smoothies after shots. <laughs> um, but after that, it's been pretty much HB gas. HB gas. H-E-B and gas. we shouldn't do those one off dinners at the grocery you, store. No, I don't do that anymore. You and then, that? The, yeah. And then the 7 Elevens. That's like my son's. So I have not given him 7-Eleven in almost, it's almost been a month. Well, what is it? What's the purchase? That's, so when I pick him up from preschool. Oh, it's the young one? He wouldn't even remember it. I know. What is it? What's the purchase? It's just like a smoothie and a fruit cup. Or it's like his little fun thing that he likes to do. I want you to do that. I want you to be doing that not every once in a while. I want you to do that every single day. We get there by getting out of debt and having an emergency fund. Yeah. Then, so I've told him no. Like, Dude, with your lot. income, when you have a fully funded emergency fund, you're, you're spoiling the f- out of them. You're honestly probably paying for the 15-year-old's college quite easily. I, I am hoping to go in that direction. Yes, but we need to get yeah. out of this now by, I'm sorry, yes. cutting all the fun things. Now yes. we have $1,000 of fidelity. That's like basically nothing. And then yeah. 2900 in a retirement plan. Is that all your retirement? Pretty much. Like 3500 Yeah. Okay, that's dramatically yeah. behind for 36 and that terrifies me. Well, I never even thought about retiring. Well, it's like, time to think about I'll retiring because your kids are going to be responsible for taking care of you if you don't. I'll probably just die at work. Well. <laughs> with my patients. You never know. Something could happen Holding where you can't hands. work anymore. And... Whatever yeah. benefits and stuff, we can't necessarily realign. We don't know where things are going to last from the government. You don't know what, um, you know, who knows what it's like through the workplace at the time. So, yeah. 